welcome to this week's advanced posture tutorial. This week we'll be working on Urdhva Dhanurasana, also known as full wheel pose. So please make sure you're nice and warmed up before attempting this posture. And if you know you have some low back issues or back issues, I would suggest taking the modification and just staying in bridge pose and working on your bridge pose. Let's go ahead and get started. So come lying down on your mat with the soles of the feet hips distance apart. Hug the heels in toward the sitting bones, and then we'll start with the bridge pose. Bring your arms down, palms down, press through feet, lift the hips up, and then imagine there's a block between the inner thighs. Give it a gentle squeeze, press the backs of the arms down, lengthen through the back of the neck, activate the little back muscles, activate the glutes and the legs. And then as you exhale, slowly release the hips down, allow your hands to rest on the quads and gently press as the low back lifts off of the mat for some natural traction. Now let's come into Urdhva Dhanurasana. First, take your hands by your head and allow the elbows to point up toward the ceiling and then hug the elbows in. Press your feet down, press through the hands and come to the crown of the head and pause. Don't let the elbows splay out, hug those elbows back in, squeeze that imaginary block between the inner thighs and then when you're ready, inhale, press up and lift. Try to straighten out the arms as much as possible. Pull your chest toward the back of the space. Root down through the feet and hold. Look at your hands. And then exhale. Slowly, slowly, with as much grace and control, bring yourself down. And then let's counter with Supta Baddha Konasana. Soles of the feet touch, one hand to belly, one hand to heart. Take a few deep breaths. And then open the eyes if they're closed. Take the hands to the outsides of the knees. Give your shins a gentle squeeze. And then rock and roll up into a seat. So that was our advanced posture of the week, Urdhva Dhanurasana. We'll be working on that pose all week. So hopefully you can fit that into your practice. Thank you so much for watching this tutorial and I hope to see you on the mat soon.